gifts to give out before we get to the specific results. Um, I have to thank the amazing elections team that we have had this year. We have Amanda Lavelle, John Foley, and who can forget our CRO, Jesse Finn. As well as our HDRO in Brantford, Jordan Copeland. She, all of them has, have done an amazing job. We had a lot of amazing volunteers that did a great job at doing the polling stations this year. Uh, we'd also like to thank the board of directors for uh, approving some great policy this year. Yeah, they're the worst. Um, uh, we want to thank Willis for having us tonight. It's a great evening, great to be out here. Uh, and all, of course, all the Lusu staff that uh, made this happen. Um, I also, I cannot forget the campaigners. You're all out there. Give yourselves a round of, hit, a round of applause. You make or break your candidate. Their campaign is based on you and the dedication that you have. And it is amazing to see so many people so dedicated to a cause. It's fantastic. Uh, and then, of course, the candidates. We have to thank the candidates out there. We had a great race this year. It was, very, like Jesse said at the beginning of the campaign period, it was a clean, fair fight. Uh, we didn't have to give out too many demerits, so it was fantastic, so it's great to see. Um, with that, I'll just, uh, I'll, I guess I'll hand it off to Jesse for the results and the moment you've all been waiting for, so thanks again. So some of you may know that we also had an election uh, this year for the SBESS that was run through the student union system. All right, cool. Got some SBE students here tonight. That's great. So I will be starting the results with the SBSS president results. So the 2012-2013 year, the SBESS president will be Serena Brunam. In second place is Jordan Bishop, third place Adam Lawrence, and fourth place Brandon Van Dam. Okay, now for everyone's favorite part, the referendum questions. Uh, first of all, the health and dental plan. Yes, it passes. Uh, next up is the constitutional amendments to Article 3 members meetings. Uh, yes, it passes. Lots of excitement tonight. Cool. Good stuff. Constitutional changes, Article 4, Board of Directors. Yes, it passes. Uh, and uh, the Constitutional Amendment, Article 5, the uh, power of directors. And Article 6, directors' meetings, is yes, it passes. Finally, the Faculty of Science referendum question regarding the fee increase, uh, it does not pass. Okay, so moving on to some of the positions that we have elected. Again, oh, the turnout? Uh, yeah. I am happy to announce that the voter turnout for this year was, it was down from last year, which I'm a little upset about. And big off, big off. However, we still maintain one of the highest voter turnouts in the country at 31.7%. So for the elected positions, we are going to start with the WIU Board of Governors. They have chosen their governor to be Michael Galliano. In second place with Seth Warren, with Scott Fleming in third place. Now for the Student Union Board of Directors. 
I'll be starting with the 15th director and working my way up to the first director who has gained uh, the most votes. So, in the 15th place, your first new director-elect is Sebastian Dudek. Fourteenth place is Ryan Neufeld. Thirteenth place is Jeff Vinson. Twelfth place, Kate Stevenson. Eleventh place, Caleb Okuvido. Tenth place, I think. Jennifer Tabarowski. Ninth place, Matt Castleman. Eighth place, Scott Fleming. Seventh place, Jasmine Edwards Clement. Sixth place, Jordan Epstein. Fifth place, Alicia Appleby. Fourth place, Hannah Lee. Third place, Deanna Sim. Second place, Seth Warren. And in first place, John Price. Union <laughs> president for the 2012-2013 year. I'll be announcing this in first, second, and third. So for the 2013, 20, sorry, 2012, 2013 year here at Laurier, your student union president is Michael Onabar. <laughs> <laughs>